this way. Sit down the road. Close your leg, bro. I go close your leg. I bomb you, close your leg, bro. Oh, look, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. And they were asking they, for $100. And they were asking me to give them $100 US from where? <laughs> they threaten you, they'll be like, it's okay if you don't give, you are not safe. Something like that. I can try it. Like a threat, threatening me. Hey, I will want a hand and turn it now. I'm putting it in a bag. At the back of that pillar. When I first started my YouTube channel and decided that I'm going to make this a travel channel, that we are going to see the world. In 2021, I did a challenge of visiting 21 countries in 2021. Nigeria was the first West African country that I visited. It was amazing. It was exciting. I was up and down. We went everywhere trying to experience Nigeria. I felt like I was a scene, like I was in a scene from the Nigerian movies that I always watch, that people watch all over the world, I mean. So it's really nice to be back to the old familiar streets of Lagos, Nigeria. I've seen a lot of changes over time. I remember during that first visit, I did a video whereby I was talking about the rapid transport system that they have. They call it BRT, whereby it's these buses that have a dedicated lane that you can board if you're trying to serve on time. There's so many ways of getting around here in Lagos. They have Okada. Okada is the motorbikes. They have downfall. Downfall are the yellow vans or buses that you'll normally see. You've probably seen that in Nigerian movies. And then they also have the white ones that operate in this area, like this one that's about to pass us, that one. Those ones operate here in Victoria Island. So today, I want to go to downtown alone. I just noticed that for the most time that I have been or visited Nigeria, I've never gone to downtown alone. So really, this is going to be my first time to downtown, to Marina, because right now, Nigeria or Lagos finally has train. It has a train system. I think they have a blue line and a red line operating in the area. For a city, the most popular city in Africa, I think this is something really great. Over 20 million people live here in Lagos. So let's head to downtown, to Marina to catch the train. Almost every building on this street is Zenith. We have Zenith Bank on, on to my left. We have Zenith Insurance. We have some other banks as well. Like most banks are on this street, but the most popular, everything that I read is Zenith, 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 everywhere, which is one of the banks here in Nigeria. I'm crossing my fingers, hoping that everything will go smooth. I'm going to catch a downfall. Public transport at the Echo Roundabout that will take me to where I will catch the train. Hello, I'm good. Oh, I forgot to say this. How far 
<laughs> how una day now how una day is not una day treated as una day but it's how una day that's how you greet people here in nigeria another greeting that i noticed another greeting that i had and i didn't know it was a greeting is like well done well done well done sir well done madam that's like greeting someone meet somebody and then they'll be like well done I would have thought like well done is like you know congratulations but here in Nigeria you can say well done sir you'll greet someone and they're gonna respond with that Victoria Island is mostly commercial, but there's residential areas around here. Some few people live here, but a lot of people from the mainland work here. So we have Lagos Island, and then we have mainland, and they are connected by a bridge. So where we are right now is in Lagos Island. We're going to catch a train to mainland. See, we have another Zenith building on this side. For your visa, Belgium, Australian, the TLS Center is right here in Victoria Island. Living in Victoria Island, it's considered one of our expensive places, but a nice place to live. It's pricey, but really nice. And obviously a very safe environment to live in. We are right here, but I think I need to cross to the other side. Very few people here recognize the zebra crossing. A lot of times you have to use more of your eyes. Look at this. Does it look like it's going to be slowing down on zebra crossing? No. So you have to mostly use your eyes as opposed to thinking, oh, I have right of way. This is zebra crossing. You don't do that in Nigeria unless you want to be hit. It doesn't matter if it's zebra crossing or whatever. Use your eyes. It's like fast come, fast to be served. It doesn't matter pedestrian or car. It's fast come, fast to be served basis. We're probably going to catch one of those small ones.
You use your eyes again to cross. This area is called the Echo Roundabout. I need to figure out at this place which vehicle I'm going to take. To Marina. Marina Marina Okay. Uh, uh, okay. So, this is 500 Naira. Marina CMS. Thank you. My goodness, I should have carried my. I think it's still three. Driver. Oh, you also have a card? Huh? You have your card? card? No. Okay. Can I, how do you get the card? What do they need to? No, no. So don't bother about it. Oh, okay. All right. So is this one going to take us to the place where we can take the train? Yes. Oh, you're going to take the train? Okay, nice. And you probably get one then. Oh, how much is the card? It's not cost. It's not cost. Why you get it? So I can get it from where the... you are going. Okay, okay, nice. Yeah, so I just got that down for. I'm going to be heading to Marina where we shall be catching that train from that stop, from that point. Especially when she reckless. Remember, you're my bestest friend. Yeah, she's my bestie. My love for you is endless. Nobody else can end it. And when I get the money back, then baby girl, you can spend it. Everything is alright I like how you're doing alright, alright Like how you think alright Always on top of yeah, oh yeah Like how you do it alright Everything good alright, alright Like how you think alright Always on top alright, oh yeah I wanna know it tonight I wanna be the one to surprise you Wake you up in the morning I wanna be the one that you call So they have these blue buses that you can take. Bye! <laughs> that you can take. These are part of the BRT system. Yeah, the blue and white. Okay, so we just 
first alighted here in CMS, I thought I was going to be alighting at Marina. Do you mind, do you mind being on my video? <laughs> I've met this gentleman here. Let me turn the camera. Let's cross. <laughs> I just ran across the road. <laughs> <laughs> well, so I just met this gentleman here. Hello, what's your name? Williams. Williams. Williams has offered because I was about to come off at Marina, but he's oh. offered to take me to the train. to the train station. Station. Thank you so much, William. Welcome. You know, um, when I stepped out today, I was like, okay, I'm just going to go with the flow. One thing I know about Nigerians is. I'm going to get help. I knew someone would, someone somewhere would help me. Nigerians are so friendly and they're gonna help you. If you're visiting, if you need help, trust me, that you're gonna get someone that's gonna help you. So back here at downtown. This is more like downtown, yeah? No, it's not downtown. This is here, this is more. The downtown is kind of a rookie area. A rookie area. A rookie area where you find out. Um, don't see this structure. Mm -hmm. You don't see the structure, so this area is kind of funny. Oh! Uh, so. so, no finish, like in complete building? I uh, can't find this complete building. Ah, okay. So, what's the difference between the bus that you took versus this yellow one and versus the, and versus this, the white one? Okay, good, cool. yeah. All the buses are, are heading almost the same places. We are crossing. We are crossing. Got the fog. Uh -huh. So the difference is depending on where you are going to. Yeah. They are all down mm -hmm. So all buses have this location. Okay. The one you enter is also BRT. Yeah. Which is going to either CMS, uh -huh. Maitu, uh -huh. Aboju, Okoko, and thereabouts. Okay. So depending on where you are heading to, we determine the buses you are following. Okay. Yeah. So we're walking towards the side. How about the road? So the yellow one for mainland? The yellow one goes to the mainland, yes. And this white one walks on the island. And sometimes they walk on the main, on the island too, the yellow one. The yellow one? Sometimes walk on the island, but mainly you find the white one on the island. So they sell old clothes here, yeah, they call them OK clothes. OK, OK. It's more like a fairly used clothes. Yeah, it's, it's called a fairly used clothes. Fairly used. Yeah. We call them Tumba. In Tumba. Kenya. We call them OK, that's Okrika. Okrika. Yeah, that's what we call them. So an Okrika market. We don't like Okrika, I call them. It's market for clothes. You can get a good designer one here. It's definitely. But we use. Use, yeah. Ah, if I tried to figure around this place alone, I would have been lost. Ah, uh, maybe I was sent to help you today. Yeah, you were sent to help me today. Because I always believe one thing that yeah. every day you wake up, there's always somebody set aside to help you in life. Uh -huh. It's like you meet the person or you don't get to your destination where that person will help you. So, that day is over. Thank you so much. Oh. This way. Take this way. Let's sit down here. Close your leg, bro. I want to close your leg. I bomb you close here, I go. Look, no, 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 no. It's normal. You know the reason why I'm saying that? Because sometimes, yeah. if you pass here again, uh -huh. nobody will arrest you. Nobody will arrest you again. But it's, it's, it's not normal. It's right. not normal. It's, it's not, not good. It's not right that these people think they can run the streets like I don't know how to put it like we need like they've normalized it it's a thing 
uh, the fact remains that the government has allowed it like that, so there's nothing yes. they can do. I think I don't like what actually I have to say. I love Nigeria. It's not my first time in Nigeria, but probably my first time this year. Yeah? Okay. I'm first time here. I love So one thing I really don't like is the fact that people have normalized. They've really normalized like harassing people. Like it's normal. And everyone says, if you know this is Lagos, this is Lagos, Lagos, just accept it. It shouldn't be like that. Yep. Because like they think it's normal. Like they're the one running the area and all that. This thing, I don't know, they call them the area boys or something. It shouldn't be like that. It shouldn't be like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. Because uh, it will happen I would again. Not, I would not let no, it's not the first time. We've been harassed before in a car with my friend. Seriously? And also on a motorbike. Uh, so it's really not, it's really not right. So we were just passing by them. And they were asking for 100 dollars. And they were asking me to give them 100 US dollars. From where? <laughs> asking, do I asked them, do look like 100 US dollars? Like to be walking around 100 US dollars to give people to leave me in the streets. Uh, just let it go. This is happening sometimes. I tell you, they'll be like, it's okay if you don't give, you are not safe. Something like that. I can try it. Like a threat, threatening me. I wanted to actually not give them. I'd rather give you because you've helped me, you know? Don't but worry. I cannot just give someone who's harassing me. Money. Yeah. It's not right. I think I'll be taking the chair with you. Oh, you take the chair with me? Yeah, just here. Oh, nice. Thank oh. you. Because the stress going back there is... Oh, which it's... area are you going to? Going to my two. My two? Yeah. Okay, I'll go with you. I'll pay your ticket. Uh, don't worry about it. I'll no, Anna, Anna, Anna. <laughs> you are so kind. I'll set it down. You are so kind. I'll set it myself. Oh. Going to that train so I'm actually working with the tigress of Africa. I never planned it. African tigress. <laughs> it wasn't my plan today, you know, my dictionary, but oh, it's nice meeting you, though. Yeah, and the Kenya for the first time. It's my first time talking to a Kenya, though. First time? Yeah, so. Oh, have you met Kenya? And, and I thought you're a Ghanaian. Yeah. You say <laughs> so, I speak like a Ghanaian. Yeah, you do. No. I think Nigerians sound more like Ghanaians. Huh? We have differences our words, it's a pronunciation with different. Uh -huh. uh. Okay, I see the station right ahead. The first time when I came, I think I saw this being built. I thought it was going to be a bus. Okay. This uh, is the train track. Yes. That's the question you know after when you saw it. Because she did not ask when you saw it, though. Nobody told me anything. That was 2021. Did you ask a question? Someone mentioned it. They are building a road. So <laughs> I didn't bother asking. Because they told me they are building a road. OK. Because we did do some drone shots. Not here, but somehow down close to the CMS. OK. So when you get there to the station, yeah. it's been a while, but I lost my card. So you buy the card, I don't know how much you sell now. So you buy the card. After you can use the card for this train station. Uh -huh. And also use the same car for the same bus. Those buses we saw. Yeah. Those the blue, blue and white bus. So we're going to buy the car. Then we buy the car once we go to the station now. Okay. Then they ask you how much you want to put inside. So you are going tow and flow, right? Yeah. So I don't know how much it's going to be. How much is it? Two? It's been a while, I don't know. Okay. Since I misplaced my car, I rarely came back to use the train. You've not really visited, have you visited? There are some places you need to visit on the island. Which places? Like uh, Nikkei Art Gallery, you come for Nikkei Art Gallery. I've been there in the 2021. 
I've heard about the conversation center. No. Conversation center? No. I need to visit there. Try and see some of the cool beach we have also. Oh, okay. We have the Boda Beach. I think that's where I can remember. The Boda, the Wave. We finally made it to the marina station. This is the main station here on the island. Sorry for the bad audio, it gets better soon. Unfortunately, I didn't realize after the interaction or after that incident with the area boys, my audio got interfered with. Ooh, so, we made it. <sighs> Those stairs. <laughs> this is the entrance to the train station, the marina station. Thank you. Let me pant. Huh? Oh. Like that? Ticket. Yeah. Oh, ticket office. So the first thing you need to get a card this is really nice the station are just like the ones i've seen in the western countries how much They will need your number. So we just purchased. Which one is my card? This is card. Oh, it's called Kauri. Kauri, the Kauri card. It's okay if you're not sure. Oh, okay. So it's called the Kauri card. So this is the train schedule up here. If you want to know when the next train is coming, you're going to check up here. And then this is how you check your balance, how much you have left in your card. Are you a tourist? Yes, I am. Okay. <laughs> So let's go, let's go. I like it. So is the which platform? Is it platform two? But why are people going? We have to stay on this queue. Oh we have to be on the queue? Yeah. Okay then. So your card, you're gonna make your payments on this machine. Okay. For going down. Alright. Yeah. So we're getting in now. Okay. Oops. Yeah, enter, enter, enter. Okay. They need to work on the things. Yeah, they close too soon. Those things, the barrier, closes too soon. Okay, so this is really nice. If they can do this all over the city and make the bus, the, the, the moves more frequent. Yeah, like to make it frequent, maybe every 5, 10, 15 minutes or 20 minutes. That will be, that will be like, no one will need a bus or a downfall. Oh, the, the train is already here. But this is... Oh, so the one we're waiting is coming from the other side. Who is it going to come from? Okay, I want to be there. I want to catch it when it's coming. Huh? Yes. This is nice. Marina Station. Let me get it. National Theatre Station. Wow. 
the Cori card, which is the card that you use for transportation, cost 600 naira, which is approximately 36 cents in US dollars. This is nice. Oh, it's cool. Love it. Finally, in the train, very nice and clean and very well air conditioned. I love this. So, I don't know how long we're going to wait before we leave. Probably some 35 minutes. Let's see. Next station is Marina. Oh, this station is Marina. So, yeah. Oh, we're leaving. The next station is the National Theatre Station. Doors open on the right. Please mind the gap between the train and the platform while boarding or alighting. This is train. lovely. Alight that we are finally here so this is what they call the Lagos light rail also known as the Lagos rail mass transit system and this is a major project aimed at solving one of the biggest challenges here in Lagos traffic if you've ever been caught or if you've ever been stuck in Lagos traffic you know how crazy it can get <laughs> With a clear view of the skyline and the lagoon, it's moments like these that make the Lagos light rail a really special experience and the best of it all. No traffic jams. <laughs> This light rail is a game changer. Imagine cutting your travel time in half and in a much comfortable way. So let's experience it together. What do you think about this transport, like with the trains, and when did it start operation? Do you know when it started operation, and how do you find it? I can't remember when it started because I don't have record of it. Yeah. But I find it very good. What do you love about it? I love it because of its security. Wow. That's fun. Like, I can come at night, now, enter the tree, and go home safely. Or like taking a, taking a bus by 8.30 or 9. I get you have uh, there are, once you're taking the bus at night you have this uh, less risk here with your stuff or okay. so once you're on the train at least taking to your final destination you get and you're free. So this is the light rail. I saw they called it the Lagos light rail. Okay. Nice views. We need more of this. 
So, how many routes are in operation right now? How many routes or routes are in operation? No, no, I just need from Marito uh, to CMS, that's what they have now. Okay. They are still walking down to Badabri and they're walking down to, I think, I don't know, but I know they are walking down from Marito to Badabri. Okay. Walk is on progress here. The next station is National Theatre. We have just arrived at one of the stops. The entire ride was smooth, fast, and honestly a relief from the usual chaos on the roads. I can totally see why people are calling this a game changer for Lagos. Doors open on the left. I'm not so sure if I've visited that place before. Do they have performances there? Ah. I think they, they did a show, they performed, they have a performance, I don't know if it's now or they've done it, uh -huh. but there is a show there, okay. but I don't know if they've done it or not. You know one thing I love, I love the seats, they are easy to clean, they are clean and easy to clean because they are not cloth material, so these are nice and easy to clean. It's really nice to see this. Is this a brewing company? Brewery? Yeah. It's a brewing company. Look at it. That's it. Down. Yeah. The entrance is at the other side of it. What do they brew? Beer. Yeah. Um, stout. Gouda. Oh, stout. Yeah. Uh, stout, Gouda, Heineken, Guinness, Malt. Varieties of beer. market where they're selling animals yeah the cows cows yeah okay we can refer them to you we can we can refer them to you that your message when you send me this point all right no problem Called Orile. Called what? Orile. What? What's the place for? It's a bus stop. Oh. That is the first bus stop you stop when you take those white buses to go into my oh, the okay. white coaster. This so, is the first their first bus stop. It's called Orile. All right. And they have the Biaotu Lane also. Look at where that boy is passing by. This middle, the middle one there, yeah. it's called the Bia Hotel Lane. Oh yeah, the dedicated yeah, yeah, lane. Yeah, the Bia Hotel Lane, yeah. this is the relay. Okay. Down to this side. This is a really bus stop. Huh? A really bus stop. This is a bus stop here. This place, this is a really bus stop. Okay. So we're heading to Igongi, where it's going to stop. What's our next stop? Igongi. 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 Oh, Igongi. Igongi. Yeah, so when I go back, I'm going to sit on the other side to see what's on that other side. I love this. This is so smooth, so comfortable. It saves you the hassle and parcels, the downfall. <laughs> the downfall, because downfalls are not the most comfortable. So this is, we need more of these, hundreds of these. Like hundreds going everywhere, then you'll not even need to own a car, because you'll be having like, you know, ease, ease of transportation. Yes, they're gonna hopefully let's hope that they're going to have <laughs> hopefully let's hope we're going to have more lines and probably to even go further than they are going, like make them longer. Like one should go straight all the way to VI 
not take it. Oh, they're going to connect it to VI. That would be amazing. So we've made it to our final station for now. Mile two. So did this train take the dedicated lane? Was this the dedicated lane? Oh, so these were the places where the BRT was operating. So now they've replaced it with the... Uh, okay. So let's get out. Oh. Oh, I love this. Hold on, let's see, let's see. Hold on, hold on. Let me have a look at the station first. Let's walk this and use this one. You said I have to go up. Yeah, you go upstairs. Yeah. You, the card is I have my card, yes. So this is the same train that, now this is the train that's going to go back. Uh, yes. So I need to tap it. And you need to come back fast. So you can go this one. Or you have to wait for the next one. I want to go with this one. So you have to... So that I can save on time. Uh, okay. Well, video there because I think... Why you to back to but uh, the people who are inside, where did they board? They just entered. They just entered? Yes. Can I just go back without? But you have to pay. Uh huh. Okay. okay. Well, well, so that's an experience. Going to tap and still come back this way. We're going back to where we came from. I have to be fast, right? Tap out. Tap out and tap in. Thank you so much. I think that's tapping out. No? No, that way. That's tapping in. This is tap out. That's tapping in. So the people who are tapping in, where are they passing? Yeah. Okay, okay. So this is the final bus stop. So I need to tap to go back in. All right, William, thank you so much. Nice. We'll chat on Instagram. You have my Instagram handle. All right, drop me a message when you get home. Okay, okay, cool. Okay, bye. All right. I'm going back in. I just wanted to experience this. Um, I wanted to talk to some people, you know, to try and get their opinion, what they think about this. However, I feel like my interaction with those bullies, the area boys, like kind of killed my vibe a little bit, but thank goodness for William, because he really helped me. So let's get back in. The beauty of this journey is that it really puts things into perspective. From up here, you see how massive Lagos is and why a project like this is so important. The blue line we are riding in is just one of the many lines planned, including the red line, which will connect Abado to Marina, covering even more ground and helping more people to get to where they need to go.
about this system is that it's connecting different parts of Lagos in a way that's faster and convenient. Each station is strategically placed, so whether you are heading to a market, a business meeting, or just exploring the city, the trains got you covered. I feel like it actually offers the best views of Lagos as a tourist. You get to see more compared to when you will be in a bus or a dump. back to where it all started and so what's the verdict for me it's a yes the lagos light trail is efficient modern and above all it gives you your time back something priceless in a city as busy as lagos whether you are a daily commuter or just visiting i highly recommend trying it out i know i'll be back for more As Lagos continues to grow, this is a huge step forward in solving one of the biggest challenges, of course, traffic. I'm excited to see how it evolves over time and how it will change the way people move around in this amazing city. One of the things that I noticed and I love about these stations is that they are going to be super convenient. I spotted some shops, stores and even a pharmacy right inside the station. So if you'll need to grab a snack, pick up some essentials or even fill a prescription, you won't have to step out into the busy streets to do it. I can already imagine a future where people park their cars at the station, hop onto the train to work and do their shopping right here at the station before heading home. It's super practical and it's going to save so much time. I can't wait. So after coming from the station, you can come here to the basement and catch up a bus to continue with your journey. Okay, here we are. 
can see we have some big sheep on the other side. Where is this one going to? And that one's going to see Hey, I come, come, see me. No, no, me. No going. Not CMS. All of them are going to CMS. Which one? The one at the front. Okay. Thank you so much. So after you come from the train. Hello. Hi, how are you doing? I remember me. I brought this man. Oh, you the same one? Oh yeah. <laughs> I got a card now. Okay, we got a card. Right. Yeah. Let's see if it, it has enough. Okay. Alright, so after coming from the train, when you come to the ground floor there's ground transportation right here so i've just taken the same bars coincidentally it's the exact same one the driver that i used from uh, victoria island to this place so let's head back
So what do you think about the new train, the Lagos light train? Yeah, it's okay now. There's nothing wrong with it. And the board, everything is fine. Have you used it before? Actually, I've not used it. Uh -huh. I'm just driving bus there. Uh, so you do transportation from here to there? Yes. Has it increased business for you? Uh, yes, it is pre-sales, everything. Uh -huh. yes. Would you encourage someone to try it? I'm encouraging you to try it because you've not done it. Uh, actually, I'm even trying to do it tomorrow. tomorrow. Because uh, yeah, tomorrow is my off and oh. I'm planning to go there. All right. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Okay. okay. Right. That's what rush hour looks like um, in Victoria Island. It's not as crazy as other parts. Especially going to the other side of the island, it saves you time because right now it's rush hour and if it's rush hour, trust me, Lagos traffic is no joke, you're going to get stuck there for long. So I'm so glad that we have that one, it's going to save a lot of time and I'm hoping that we're going to have more of that across the island or across Lagos, I mean across the city that is. So that will mark the end of today's episode and I hope something really needs to be done about this area boys because the problem is not even that they exist this area boys I mean there's bad people everywhere in the whole world but I think the biggest problem is the fact that people have actually normalized it the fact that people think it's normal like when you tell people they'll be like oh you know Legos boys you know or those area boys the fact that people think it's normal and the fact that these people feel like they can harass anybody it's not even the police it's not the police because i've been filming going and the police could see me filming and no problem but when it got to that point to that spot the fact that people think it's normal and even when you tell people they'll be like ah you know welcome to lagos like that's very normal in lagos it's so annoying and it kind of killed my vibe I was like in really good vibes, good energy I met William and some other lady in the downfall and it was so exciting I was just looking forward to making a very lovely a very lovely vlog of the Lagos light trail but those area boys kind of threw me off I just didn't want to pay them anything but of course 
people have kind of normalized it here so we had to give them some money but there's no way I was going to give them a hundred dollars so I just gave them some naira and that was it and continued I don't like the fact that they threaten you and tell you your safety is not guaranteed and they tell you they're in charge of security yeah they're the ones who are harassing you and getting money from you well let's hope something gets done about it or people just stop normalizing because the more we normalize them or the more we encourage them to continue harassing and bullying people Whew. those area boys they need to be stopped they kind of ruined half of my journey today half of my vibe I was just enjoying making videos confident in the streets until that point and if you're keen you kind of noticed my energy went a bit low and hoping to get a better experience next time maybe next time i'll try the red line i just learned that the red line is in operation as well but on trial basis so i'm going to try the red line and make a very lovely vlog about you know the transportation like you know the light rail and how to get around in lagos thank you so much for watching this episode i hope you learned something new let me know what you think in the comment section below don't forget to hit the like button share and subscribe i'll definitely see you on the next one until then bye bye